stuff that I write that doesn't have anything apparently to do with music. I remember one time talking to my dad. We did a lot of that. We talked and everything. And there was a certain guy running for president at the time. And I remember him saying, I've never seen a presidential candidate who lacked curiosity. I was raised to be curious. It's something that, that just, it's never gone away. Uh, I, I, as a result, this childlike fascination with the world has never left me. And it's something that keeps me going in music, keeps me willing to try new things. It keeps me from, from, from feeling middle-aged, except, you know, when I get up and my back hurts. The curiosity with things, the feeling of being youthful all the time partly comes from that from going, why well, I wonder about this. What do I, how do I learn about this? How do I learn about that? And if all I knew was music, if that was the only thing I did, I'll tell you what, I can't stand it when I'm sitting there with a bunch of musicians and everybody wants to tell everybody else how much they know about music. I, there's more to the world to, than that. In fact, how do I, how can I possibly write a song if I don't understand the rest of the world? Um, how can I hold a conversation with anybody anywhere, including students of mine, students of range from other musicians or aspiring musicians to uh, lawyers and doctors. And you know, I was once taught a brain surgeon how to play bass, uh, business owners, uh, business leaders, bankers, you name it all over. And I can hold conversations with these people, not because I'm some brainiac, but because I'm curious about these things. So I, I, I go and I find something interesting and I dive in and read further. As a result of that, I'm also able to have dialogues about things that matter even maybe more than music do. And let's talk about things like we don't know enough about and want to know more about. For instance, how can I work with uh, somebody who's not an artist and we can all benefit? Or how can music benefit what they do? Some of these things I have some experience in and some answers to. I believe a couple of things strongly at them. One, I believe the record industry is about to go through some major upheaval. And I think there's going to have to be a new way to go about things. Don't know how, but I, I'm going to do my part to figure out at least, you know, from where I'm sitting. And watching the world of business in constant upheaval, 120 year old companies failing because they couldn't adapt. Um, I'm curious about how that's affecting people in the world of business. You know, people are always networking, uh, real estate agents network with each other and with loan brokers. Makes sense to me. Uh, musicians and other artists network with each other. Uh, makes sense to me. Um, you know, uh, entrepreneurs uh, network with each other. Uh, the Chamber of Commerce, though, is something where people network across, you know, different professions and stuff. Why don't we do more of that? That doesn't make sense to me, that we don't do more of that. Uh, let's talk. Let's get to know each other. Um, I'd say let's change the world, but that'd be too hippie. Eh, let's change the world. <laughs> Have a wonderful evening. Peace. Bye.